and testimony about the grace and faithfulness of our Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus Christ and the Holy Spirit, guiding and leading us on how our church came about. Well, it was all started with the Bible study at home. Through all the years of dedication, our courageous pastor Karen and gener generous support of Sister Reggie and their kids, given and blessed, along with our gifted and anointed teacher, Mom Nelly, and knowledgeable Bishop Orlando, my extended family, Mr. Al, Nanang Consolacion, Cousin Junjun, friend Joe, my mother, Maxima, and my family, Agnes, I and myself, you see, we were just a handful and few, seemingly impossible, but with the goodness of God, <clears throat> everything is possible through faith. We know that we can do all things through Christ our Lord, who strengthens us. So, having persistent and tireless, and tireless Bible study continuously, rain or shine, by the power of the Holy Spirit directed in us. One day, our inspired Bishop Orlando ordained the day of the beginning of the church service. You know, through prayers and supplications, our petition have been heard in heaven. Therefore, we rejoice and been glad exceedingly that the Lord has it made. Yes, although there was no specific chosen name for the church, the first service has to go on. That was the first Saturday of July, year 2013. At the patio, back of the house, Pastor Karen delivered his first message into our first service. Our talented music director, Sister Reggie, along with Sister Christy and Sister Lani Lai, sang gloriously, blended with a band of Brother Ken, giving, blessed, and heal. A tambourine dance led by Sister Lani Lai was beautiful. The Thanksgiving prayer of Pastor Mani in the midst of all Sister Cecil and kids, Sister Elwil and Brother Marlon, and all the innumerable guests were happy and blessed. Most of all, the closing prayer of Bishop Orlando was an inspiration. This made our first church service memorable. Brothers and sisters, as we continue our Bible study weekly and church service monthly, as well as retreat once a year. Our small church is growing strong, smoothly, and well. Then Pastor Karen and Pastor Mani invite, invited their dear friend, Pastor Paul Kim, as the guest speaker of our first year church anniversary. All were blessed, and however, I tell you, brothers and sisters, a miracle happened. The power of the Holy Spirit does the heart of Pastor Paul. Shortly then, the gen he generously opened the door of his church for us. Pastor Paul came in behalf of the Filipino, Congre Filipino congregation and ministry. Thank you, and we are all grateful. So here we are, the Filipino ministry, Seasos Ang Pag Asa. In English, this is the hope. Join the house church, a family church. So God bless the house church and Seasos Ang Pag Asa. And God bless our third year church anniversary of 2016. After all, this is the grace of God, and to God be the glory. Amen.